Shalom, 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 Israel. This is your King and Shepherd KD with another message of daily edification brought to you through the Spirit and the power. You how about Shem Yahushai? All praises do. Um, hope y'all enjoyed those vids yesterday. Um, there's more on the way too. Um, more on the way. More information. Uh, be getting into that. Uh, hopefully a little later today. But um. This video I want to put out right now uh, is just a warning, all right, uh, to show you where we are, okay? Um, the scriptures have to be fulfilled, all right? They have to be fulfilled. And this is one scripture. <laughs> That has to be fulfilled within the next six weeks. This is why shit is happening. All right. And, and, and I'm going to get into that in a second. Um, you know, more people than got thrown out of here in the last month. than in the whole time, it, collectively, man, it's been one after the other. And still more following right now. Right now. Um, so. This is where we are. All right. Let me show y'all what I mean. Y'all give me a second to clean my peepers. All right. There we go. Let's go to uh, Matthew chapter. 13, all right, starting at verse 24, and it reads, another parable put he forth unto them, saying, the kingdom of heaven is likened unto a man which sowed good seed in his field, but while men slept, his enemy came and sowed tares among the wheat and went his way. But when the blade was sprung up and brought forth fruit, then appeared the tares also. So the servants of the householder came and said unto him, Sir, didst not thou sow good seed in the field, for whence then hath it tares? And he said unto them, An enemy have done this. The servants said unto him, Wilt thou then that we go and gather them up? But he said, Nay, lest while you gather up the tares, you root up also the wheat with them. Let both grow together until the harvest. And in the time of the harvest, I will say to the reapers, Gather ye together first the tares, and bind them in bundles to burn them. But gather the wheat into my barn. All right. So, you know that sower was Yahawashai, all right? And Yahawashai knows the difference between the wheat and the tear. See, man can't, uh, man can't, can't separate the wheat from the tears because if he tries, he can make a mistake. See? And that has to do with me. See, I'm going to tell y'all. All I know in this body is what you show me. If you tell me you're a man of the Lord, hey, I, I have no choice but to believe you're a man of the your Lord. All praise to y'all. Basham, Mashak, Yahushai. All praises. Yeah, and all that, right? Good, good, good. Good. You calling on the name. You've been here for years. Some of you, some of you walk off too, you know. Oh, praises. Oh, praises. Oh, bless you and your side. Oh, 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 all oh, praises. See, you, 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 you're growing and you, you acting like wheat, you know. You look like wheat, you know. But when the blade sprung up, that's when you've been here a while. See? 
than who you really are, it comes out and you can't hide it. All right. <laughs> Funny story, man. I I I uh I got a a a a, a brother I've known for years and uh yeah, he's in the truth. I got him in the truth years ago. And uh, <laughs> he bought a dog, man. He, you know, back then during that time, Rockwallers was the was the move. You know, every era had their dogs. The '80s, you you know, you had the the the, the Doberman Pinscher, which I never liked Doberman Pinschers. Um, seemed very disloyal to me. I don't like Dobermans. Uh, used to get their ears clipped up and all that shit. Then it went to Rockwallers. Then after that, of course, pit no pit bulls, red nose pit, blue pits, all them. You know, uh, I grew up around all that, man. You know, these niggas with their dogs. You know, know about their raising pigeons and shit and all that. You know, them roller pigeons and all that. <laughs> but anyway, um, the uh, the 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 dog that he got. It was a little puppy, man, a little cute puppy, black with the little brown around it, you know, face and everything. And dude was like, "Oh yeah, man, yeah, 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 this, this, this yeah, this, 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 uh, this a German Rockwaller, man, you know, full blooded, all right." Yeah, he was full blooded till he got a little older. <laughs> As the weeks went by, he got the money and every day, dude was gone. He out the picture. He's gone. He already knew that by the time my boy found out what he did, it was going to be way too late. So the dog got older and older and older and older and older. And his nose started coming out. You know, a Rockwaller got a, like a pug nose. You know what I mean? His nose started getting long. Now, in order for you to have, like, papers on the dog, and I don't think the dude had papers. He took his word for it, right? Um, the dog got to be full-blooded. That means if you got a full-blood, let's say, say you got a red-nosed pit, that dog got to be certified from a vet, and you have to mate that dog with another pit, another female pit, if you want the bloodline to remain intact, right? That's the pedigree. So, obviously, somebody got in the bloodline, all right? Somebody got hold of mama. <laughs> and I think what it was, a Doberman Pinscher got in the line because that's what he started to look like. His, as he got older, he was kind of, you know, kind of stocky like a Rottweiler, but he had almost like the face of a, <laughs> a, a Doberman. And he was a funny looking ass dog, man. Um... He, the bloodline was fucked up. So what it probably ended up happening, he had a female Rockwaller and then a Doberman went up in him, in her, and then got her pregnant. And then he 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 sold the puppies as pure blood Rockwallers. Because the color was there. The color was there. But it took time for that to transpire, right? Y'all want to know the funny-ass moral uh 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 into the story. I mean, it ain't funny, but it is funny. My boy dog ended up getting mauled by his neighbor's rock waller. Ain't that some shit? <laughs> he couldn't could fight him off. Now, he had a real, his neighbor had a real German bread rock waller, big ass head. I mean, this dog looked like a fucking bear. Tore his ass up because he slipped under the gate. And that dog, then one company that day whooped his ass, all right? <laughs> Why did I say that? Well, we got people in this body that are like that. That's what the wheat and the tares is about. We got people in here that's really wheat. And when Yahweh Shai come back, he's going to harvest them, all right? Me, I'm wheat, I'm wheat. You know, I, I bear fruit. <laughs> um, with me, what you see is what you get. I ain't phony with nobody. I ain't no. Look, if you think I'm an asshole, 
All right, so be it. Maybe I am in your eyes, but I'm an honest asshole. I, 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 I don't switch for nobody. You dig what I'm saying? How you see me is how I am. Now, uh, like I said, there's been people that have been found out in here in the last couple of months and thrown out because they came in fronting like they was wheat and they was tares. And Yahweh Shai is bringing up situations in their lives to show you who they really are. And this is how they get separated. Damn, I didn't know you was like that. For real? Oh, okay. And I'm telling y'all, man, this shit is crazy. This shit is, is going on like it's going rampant. So we got men and women in here that they blade is springing up. Let me, let me, let me get the, uh, let me get the scripture. Verse 25, Matthew 13 and 25. But while men slept, his enemy came and sowed tares among the wheat and went his way. Now, what is that? That's people that heard this word, like this word. They just don't want to do what the word say. Okay. But when the blade was sprung up and brought forth fruit, then appeared the tares also hiding in the midst. See, the, 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 if you are really weak, you're going to bring forth fruit. A tear don't bring up, bring no fruit. A tear just spring up and it's right next to the wheat. You did. And you got people in here. That's like that. They don't bring forth no fruit. They just sitting amongst everybody like. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm elect too. I'm elect because I'm here. I'm here and uh, I'm elect. But they don't bring forth fruit. They bring forth hell. They bring forth a lot of confusion. And number one, they are disobedient to the word. Disobedient. That's how you know it's a tear. Okay? They, they have alternate lives away from the videos and away from, you know, the outings that we had. Look, don't nobody really know anybody in here. I mean, we hope to. We hope everybody is is, is is about this life, but they just not. We got men in here that's not about this life. We got men in here doing all kind of things. Maybe not a lot, but they're tears. They're tears. Because they, they, they're doing shit that they know that the most high is totally against. All right? Like what I told y'all a couple of days ago about men, you know, men in here that's supposed to be uh, um, men of the Lord, but you sitting there sleeping with other men's wives. That's a tear. All right, that's a tear. Um, and 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 women in here, you know, uh, 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 doing all manner of wickedness, man. Uh, not 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 accountable. Not submissive. And see that that's like that's like cussing a cussing a woman out uh, to say, are you submissive? If you got a hut, if you're blessed enough to even have one. They got a lot of women that don't have no husband, man. They really want one. But they got some that got them. And then now they treat them like shit. Or or or, or they're 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 rebellious. You know what I mean? If 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 you one of those women that 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 can't receive correction one of those women that like talking back that like yip yapping that don't know when to shut the fuck up that don't want to listen to your king then you would tear flat out and yahweh shy all right already got the 411 on you he got the 411 on you niggas in, uh, uh, in here too that's hiding all right so what the scriptures say? It say, but when the blade was sprung up and brought forth fruit, then appeared the tares also. See, that's how you know uh, 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 the blade is the 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 uh, the wheat, and then the tear is the one next to it that don't do nothing but just sit there. Verse twenty-seven. 
So the servants of the householder came and said unto him, Sir, did not thou sow good seed in the field? From whence then have it tares? He said unto them, An enemy have done this. The servants said unto him, Wilt thou then that we should go and gather them up? But he said, No. Lest while you gather up the tares, you root up also the wheat with them. See, you can't tell who's who because everybody got the gift of gab. Everybody got that 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 mouthpiece. You know what I mean? Everybody, man, they say all praise to Yahweh by Shimei outside 500 times a day. Uh, they they always in prayer. They're always you know trying to stay on their square. They know the lingo. They know everything they learn here. And then they put it to their use, but then behind the scenes, they fucking up. See? That's a wicked motherfucker. But see, I don't know y'all. I don't really know none of y'all. All I know is what you show me. But there's a lot of y'all that's been in here that's to switch the fuck up, man. You just switch the fuck up. And it's okay. I see you. I see you. All right? So, it's all good. But see, hey, you can get over on me, but you ain't going to get over on your house shy. Your house shy is going to be like, nope, 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 not him, not her. Hell no, not them. See, he's going to do the choosing. All right. Look, let's finish it up. Look at verse 30. Let both grow together until the harvest and in the time of harvest, I will say to the reapers, gather ye together first the tares and bind them in bundles to burn them. But gather the wheat into my barn. So he ain't gonna really have to gather nobody for the tares. All he gotta do is leave you where you at. Let me prove it to you. Let's go to Matthew chapter 24. Verse 31. Well, I'll start at verse 30. And then shall appear the sign of the Son of Man in heaven, and then shall all the tribes of the earth mourn, and they shall see the Son of Man coming in the clouds of heaven with power and glory. Verse 31. And he shall send his angels with a great sound of a trumpet, and they shall gather together his elect from the four winds, from one end of heaven to the other. So, when he sends them out, all right, to gather, he's going to be gathering the elect, the wheat, the tear, they're going to be bundled up and ready to get burned. Now, unfortunately for some of y'all that's just been in this body, taking up space, you know, wasting your own time because your heart is still wicked. Y'all are going to be in that fucking number, man. See, some of y'all, y'all, I, I don't care how I explain it, how I say it, how I talk. And it's going to be very surprising. It's going to be very surprising with, with some of y'all. Like, damn, her too? Him too? And I mean people that's then got up. They didn't came to the Rhea Mister. They didn't came to the Kassas. They didn't came to the Good God. All right. You come to all the outings. You've been watching all the videos, binge watching them, everything and all for nothing, because the one thing you couldn't do was let go of your bullshit. Come ye out from among them and be ye separate, saith the Lord, touch no unclean thing and I will receive you. But you want to touch the unclean thing. You, you want to continue in your bullshit. You don't want to be held accountable for nothing. You don't want to. Uh, 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 take the righteous blame for the shit that you fucking do, man. So, ain't no help for you. Ain't no help. See, I'm gonna tell y'all something. The, the people, the, the, the chariot riders are gonna be the elect, period. All right? Yahweh Shai is gonna gather the wheat in the barn. That's the barn. When the ships come, they're gonna be gathered up in there. Now, when you go to Psalms 110 and 3, it says, Many shall be willing in the day of thy power, and the beauties of holiness thou shalt get to do of thy youth. All right? Well, 
here's the thing. The ones that 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 um that are that are that are gonna come after us, then that's when that Ezekiel, I think chapter 20 is gonna come into play where he says, Then shall I purge out the rebels from among you. But the rebels ain't gonna be in the ships. The rebels gonna come after. Cause it's gonna be an influx of Israelites that have woken up to who they are, but they ain't gonna want to change. But we're gonna know who they are then. We're gonna see who's really about that life and who's not. And here, we can't really do that right now because number one, we separated. Got people living in Texas, Florida, uh, you know, so e everybody could be uh, uh, an elect man or woman or a saint. Then everybody can uh, 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 comment, board, bang, how they are and not their, 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 their soul in the Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai. Everybody could do that because we don't know what you're doing. We got people right now still claiming Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai. They straight alcoholics. Eyes red as fucking Roma tomatoes. Getting blasted and blitzed every night. Drunk as fuck. But guess what? Oh, they're elect though. They're elect. Because they know we can't see them. They know that. But you how much I see your ass? We got, we got, who else we got? We got, uh, we got, uh, men in here that got wicked ass intentions. All right. Out there being straight hoes. No type of, uh, 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 discipline or, or anything. You know, pussy is more important to them than the kingdom. So, they out there doing all kind of, all manner of wickedness, man. Right? Living a life of a fucking gigolo. Right? Using motherfuckers, taking their women money and shit. Same shit street niggas do. All right? But see, you slacking on your pimping when when, 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 when your Hawashai is, is looking down your ass. He see what you're doing. And he's going he gonna to expose you for who you are. And then he's going to get your, he's going to let me know. And then we're going to rush your ass out of here. Now, all of y'all ain't got to be brought up on charges like that. You know why? Because a lot of y'all are not close to me. I'm talking about brothers that are like really locked in with me. I have some, you know. I got brothers that contact me on a regular that talk to me and stuff like that. And it's, you know, unfortunately, it even be some of them that, you know, um, they not 100% with this. And then when the most high, what they do, they'll try to use, they'll try to use that bond. See, I got all kind of brothers, you know, uh, uh, that, 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 that they'll, they'll bond with me and, and then they get in good and we'll laugh on the phone. We'll be on the phone for an hour, hour and a half. Oh, good. I'm in, I'm in. So if you ever find out who I really am, he ain't got a fortitude to cut me off. Nigga, you got me fucked up. I told you. I'll eat your biscuits and your gravy and still send your ass straight to hell. I don't care how long we talk, how long, how hard we hee-hawed and laughed. I mean, I'm pretty sure some of y'all think I'm psychotic. You know? It don't matter who you are. Aquas included. They've had Aquas in there that I was really cool with, man. You know, and then guess what? They showed me who they really were. They showed me they was a tear. Mm. That's it. Just like that. Don't give it a second thought. So, since you just let y'all know, all right, it's harvest time, and Yahweh Shai getting ready to come down and reap his harvest. He finna thrust that sickle in, man. He finna get his harvest. So, if you're wheat, then all praises. If you tear, it's just a matter of time before he scalp your ass. And he he's not going to quit, man. He's going to continuously put you in situations to show your ass so that it's known by everybody that, nah, you, you was a fucking phony, man. This is why uh, the scripture is clear, man. Uh, if you're a king... You got to have discipline, you got to have wisdom, and you got to have a long-suffering forbearance. 
All right, you got to drink your cup, man. You 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 you, you got to be a man about your shit, okay? You 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 can't be no whimpering simp ass nigga, okay? You got to be 100% with the most high, man. All right? If you got a family, you're supposed to do everything you can to take care of your family. You got to work. Sometimes you got to be up late at night. All right? You got to change diapers. You got to do all that. You got to, uh, 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 you know, if you got to go to the store in the middle of the night, if you got an aqua that's pregnant, you got to take care of her. You got to rub that belly, rub them, 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 them feet. All right? Uh, uh, you might have to do a little uh, uh, cooking here and there. All right? And then you got to hold down a job, too. It take all that to be called daddy, okay? Uh, if you single, you got to have some discipline, all right? You ain't supposed to be out here living like a two-third, laying down with all these nasty-ass women and shit defiling your temple. No. You ain't supposed to be doing that, man. If you a woman, you know, and you out here, all right, if you got a two-third man that you been with and he don't want to leave, and, and, and you know, y'all, you know, he still got some love for you, maybe he will open up. We don't know. Okay, but you ain't supposed to be out here cracking your legs open, all right, for all these two-third niggas being a hoe. That's not being a princess. You just another 304, all right? If you got a husband, then your ass is supposed to be submissive to his rulership and his leadership. That's your king. All this yip-yapping, back-talking, down-talking, publicly embarrassing, a, king, a man of the Lord, you on dangerous ground. You don't know what you're doing because, see, you're asking a man, okay, to take care of you for eternity, but you won't respect him here. That ain't going to happen. That ain't going to happen. One thing men of the Lord are not going to have to worry about in the kingdom is women. There's going to be too many of them. So, you'll either be there or you won't. Keep bumping your gums. Keep, keep being on demon time, and it's going to cost you. That's my, that's my promise to you, all right? So, uh, the tares are those who are insincere and fronting like, uh, they in, they, 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 they're about this kingdom and they're not. All you're going to do uh, 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 is get gathered up and burned. All right? That's it. So, uh, I know this is going to still fall on death ears because if you not elect, you just not elect. The most high is just going to continuously put you in position to be that nigga or the bitch that you are so that you can go ahead and expose yourself fully so that we can go ahead and do what we're going to do and get your ass out of here. All right. Oh, and another thing. He said one shall two shall be in the field, one taking the other one left, right? Two shall be grinding in the mill, one taking the other one left. Most are so cold with it, man. You could have a man of the Lord. You could have a mixed family. Or a woman of the Lord with a mixed family, and that man get left behind, and that woman take his son with her and leave a nigga behind because he was a tear. You could have a man that's a man of the Lord and take uh 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 uh, uh his stepson, you know, because his stepson really loved the Lord, and because of his example, all right. The Most High uh, uh, woke that little child up. That man and that 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 father and that stepson who's not even his blood, because that boy woke up on that father, take him and leave a raggedy ass mama behind. See, you you don't know how it's gonna go. It's only gonna happen once. So keep playing and see where the fuck your ass land at, man. This ain't no goddamn game. Keep telling y'all. So. This is where we at, man. This is where we at. All right. I'm going to give all praise to you. How about Shema Mashiach Yahweh Shai? Think about this shit. See y'all on the next video. KD out. Shalom.